Morning. A bit cloudy. Anyway, hope you're doing well. Motion sensor light. Of course, I'm not hoping that for any of this mess. Anyway, did you watch my tarot card video? What did you think? <laughs> I think I did okay. Anyway, me text my mom, my sister Tracy and me, like on Thursday or something, I forget, maybe on Friday, saying, asking us if we wanted, or she asked what time Tracy went to work on, t on Sunday, today, at Michael's, and then, we should go grab breakfast at Jim's this morning because she wants to spend the day um, relaxing at her house. And guess what? Turns out we're not getting breakfast at Jim's together. Tracy texts her back. You should rest, Kimmy, since you've been working. Which is very unusual because usually she's always like, We never get to see you. It's so good to see you. I look forward to seeing Kimmy. And she gets upset, like, if we don't get to see her at least once a week. So that was unusual. I tell Tracy, hey, when do you work? <laughs> you don't want to get breakfast at Jim's? So I asked my mom last night, I said, so are we going to have breakfast with Kimmy? She said, no, Kimmy's just going to rest. I guess I had my allotted time with my own sister when the AC people failed to do their job for nine hours. Is what that looks like to me. So, that's a bummer. So no breakfast at Jim's a restaurant we all love this morning. So I think usually she has like before she visits us on Sunday, she usually like what's usually been in her schedules either she walks Andy or she has brunch like with people I don't know so <laughs> see the little kitty cat what's 
going on, Benjo? Hey, oh. Benjo, no sir, no sir. Hi. Sorry. <laughs> anyway, so that's a bummer. Don't get to see my sister and don't get to have breakfast. I just was so that's that. Anyway. Banjo. Oh, I thought it was a person. I think it's just a cat. Benjo! 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 One second. Okay. So anyway... What else? What else? What else? You'll see the ants. Can you see them? I don't know if y'all can see them. Of course, video quality is not good. I can already tell. So wait a minute, you can see every wrinkle, but you can't see my skin tan? That makes total sense. Anyway. If you saw those ants, I don't know if you could see them. We have those ants in our house. It's going to be another week. People going in our house. So last, my mom has a exterminator scheduled officially. Don't know what to do with the pets other than lock them in a room that's not going to get sprayed. And it's going to take 45 minutes for the stuff to dry. That's what I was told. So. So good, that's less than an hour. Some randos are gonna be in our house. Let's go, Benjo. Oh, look, they get Sundays off. Right? Must be nice. And Nikki Haley. Well, it's crazy. You get some days off since you have a kid. Also, there's like poop literally in the street there and then two places over there in that little Squaw Creek, Honey Creek area. Like literally just in the street. Been there for a while. And part of me is thinking, you know what? Benjo! No sir! No sir! Benjo! Benjo! And part of me is thinking, you know what? 
that's probably the least destructive route that these gross human traffickers take. Sunday's off, must be nice. Oh, and if you're wondering, the air condition is supposed to be, they get the weekend off, the air condition company. They only work weekends when it's an emergency. So they're scheduled for tomorrow to fix the bathrooms. They can stay nine hours in one day. It's worse than what it was before they spent nine hours in that house. Then they have to come back at 9.30, but they don't show up until 12.30 and then they can't stay long enough to fix the bathrooms. They have to wait a weekend and then show up on Monday to fix the bathrooms. Did you see that fence? Anyway. And for the life of me, I don't know what, like, this entire time, I mean, y'all can see it. When was I, like, oh my gosh, I'm getting filmed, there's a live stream, is it my phone that they're watching me through, what's going on here? Shame me, and then I was like, this whole time, every mistake, everything I've ever made, they're being like, oh, she smokes weed, so... We can't really talk to her. She can't have a good job. You know, stuff like that. And then they think they're going to get away with this. Like, what lifestyle are you a part of? You know, every, every day I get so mad at that. And that's another thing about human trafficking, right? is so you telling me I could just go knock on their door and be like hey can I google myself can I go into your computer real quick so and then you think well what's that's not happening right so what's the incentive there? Of course, I trust my mom and my two sisters completely. I have family that's not fake family. It's just frustrating because it, it seems like this it can, everything can be solved so easily. But every time I step out the house, anytime some random goes into this house, It's like, I'm not a public figure. I hate it. Rinju! And as far as all that goes, so who are you talking to? Because it's not me. There's a social media company, and I'm over 18, and you're not talking to me? I got the little ants right here too. So anyway, Carizona, I saw Carizona was out milking a cow and 
serving beer behind a bar in Iowa. Oh, but you gotta look at me a certain way because I smoke weed. Absolutely ridiculous. And again, I'm from San Antonio, Texas. I don't think I can't, and then y'all can attest, right? There's been a live stream, right? I don't think I don't think I've ever met one Republican that's been like, no, weed needs to be illegal. Not a one. Been my whole life in San Antonio, Texas. Never been. I am Republican, and part of what defines me as a Republican is making weed illegal. And if you have it. And you're around it. You need to go to jail. Let alone marijuana induced schizophrenia. Never heard of such a thing in my life. Anyway. So it's another day, another dollar. What motivates somebody to do this? I'm not a public figure. You're not even going to talk about me. So I know little Matt Gates doesn't talk about me when he's on Trump Force One, right? Oh, hey, how's Michelle doing? She's doing, looks like she's doing a lot better. Her company, how's that going? Yeah, I don't think that conversation happens there. You want to know why I think that? Because that conversation doesn't happen here. So. Anyway. Absolutely ridiculous. I, I'm just grateful that there's people who are... Um, that there's good people who are keeping up. And I'm, I'm grateful, actually, that there's, um, this isn't hidden. It's all out in the open, so. At least there's that, right? Anyway, I'm going to get started with my little morning routine if I had marijuana that would be even better I have cash and money my mom gives me like 20 sometimes she gave me a 20 as a tip for cleaning the house and she gave me another 20 recently uh, with the air conditioning so So that's just going to be the time, you know, they're probably waiting, right? So y'all got some plan Harass me just to harass me. And I have no doubt they do stuff like that. So look, she's going to smoke and then we're going to mess with her. I said, I've waited this long. Might as well just wait even longer. So when I'm free, I'm 
And can you believe that? Matt Gates is the oh Matt Gate Matt Gates gets to be the one that's like, hey, f for military we should make weed legal. No shame. Going in front of everybody saying that. Okay, Matt Gates, I wonder how many friends you're gonna make with that. But anyway. <sighs> not a date, not a dollar. Trying to make the best of the situation. And again, it must be tiring for them to be so pathetic. Is my guess. Thank you. Anyway, 20 minutes. Guess I'll talk to you later. Hope you'll have a good one. I have everything to look forward to, and Matt Gates doesn't. Haha. -ha.